And Emily has switched locations for us this morning to the old federal building in downtown Grand Rapids. Yeah, and also we saw her running through the streets as well. <laughs> we'll look at some more of those art prize exhibits. Hey, Em. Hey, we're definitely causing a scene out here this morning. A lot of curious lookers driving by. But I'm here with artist Jimmy Keenly and his inflatable suits that have traveled the world with him. Jimmy, first of all, these suits are crazy. They're fun. You made them yourself. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I made them out of urethane-coated nylon with a sewing machine, all handmade. Now, you made this one in Finland. Yeah, I made this one in Finland. This one was made in Japan. And Whatever inspired you to create something so big like this? Well, I always had the dream of being really huge but in a small package. I always want to have things hidden under my clothing so I can infiltrate official locations and then be bigger than any, everyone Tell else in the room. Tell us about last night what you did. <laughs> oh, well, I, I went into the Lion Center where the Art Prize opening party was, and I you know, just walked in with my little bag, and then about seven minutes later, I am as big as the the whole pavilion there and I was told that I was a little unsafe so yes, I went security. ahead and took the, the party down the street and had a lot more fun in Grand Rapids. Yeah we were talking earlier um, back in the day I asked if you ever got it through airport security and then all, you know all of a sudden they had this massive inflatable suit in the middle of the airport. Yeah yeah you can't do that anymore but I used to have a lot of fun doing things like that. Um, okay well why don't you hop in this one and sure. uh, give us a little dance. Yeah Just it's pretty you easy it. Just Put the power pack on and... What is it powered by? It's powered by a 12-volt fan. Then you put it on. There he goes. Just like that. Well, it looks like a lot of fun. Do you ever have anyone else in your suits? Or is it just you? What? I can't. Woo yeah, he can't hear. Do you, ever, do you ever have anyone else in the suit? Ah, yeah, usually... I, when I'm wearing the suits, I find that if I look behind me, I have a trail of children and no parents. And then I have to look around, and then the kids go, we want to get in, we want to get in. So usually I have kids crawling through and having a good time, and I'll sit here. To them, it must look them. like a big jungle gym. Yeah, they, they just love it. And Come show us this one. Where did sure. you build this one? I built this in Japan, and this one's called Big Red, and this one's a lot of fun. Big Red. Watch you get in that one. Well, you'll be able to see Jimmy in his inflatable suits all around town. He doesn't really have any one location. This is his home base, the old federal building. Um, but if you're driving and you see him, go ahead and talk for him. <laughs> he takes down trees with this suit. Come back out, Jimmy. Come on back out and visit us. Um, you guys, the voting has started today. And and you can text thumbs up, thumbs down. Hey, Jimmy, last night you were one of the top 25 artists. Are you still up there? I, I haven't looked at where I am. I was trying to look on my phone, but um, it, it updates. And we don't know who's in the lead, but we know the top 25. Right, they got it in buckets to kind of have it more Hey, congrats on that. Good job. All right. You can vote thumbs up for Jimmy. Um, go to our website, fox17online.com. We have the link. And we're going to go inside the old federal building and see what else we have there. I think the big red ball guy is coming too. But I like the big red suit. Well, thank you so much. All right. Jimmy Keenly. Back to you guys. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, he can't bring those in, into the building, can he? Yeah, I don't They're already blown so. up. No fast movement. That's right. He might poke someone's eye. Yeah, I thought he was going to run right into Big the building.